New York City. Brooklyn, 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 Brooklyn. I'm actually from Brooklyn originally. I've lived in Texas for almost 20 years now, but I'm back in Brooklyn, ready to eat bagels. Does this city ever sleep? I barely sleep. Shit. New York. The land of opportunity, the land of mischief. Rats, human rats. It always feels a little nostalgic coming back here. I still got a little New York in my heart. Apparently I say the word forest like a New Yorker. Someone in Texas asked me, are you from Long Island? Because I said forest. But apparently in Texas you say forest. I don't say it like that, that sounds weird. We're in the middle of some kind of race right here. There's so many things going on. Palm trees in the middle of New York City. This building is on another level. Look at this thing. We're standing in the future. New York is just on another level. I love Austin, but it is a rinky-dink city compared to this. Look at this. When I was a kid growing up in Brooklyn, I used to come to the city and look at the World Trade Center, the old World Trade Center. I used to look up at the tower and be like, oh my god, that is so tall. I would feel queasy because it looked like the buildings were swaying side by side, which they actually technically are. But I remember feeling just so tiny. And there's something nice about feeling really tiny amongst all the giant stuff in the world. God, these buildings are huge. I feel like a little ant. I'm about to fall on the damn street. That building looks like the alien ship that I took to land on planet Earth. I'm going to be reboarding that ship again eventually to go back to my homeland. Origins unknown.
photography is kind of tricky because you can't always tell if somebody wants their photograph to be taken. But I feel like once you whip the camera out and you start recording, be polite, smile, smile at people, and they'll probably let you take their picture.